Hello students, good morning. Uh, 10th standard chemistry, we have discussed many topics using the YouTube links. Now, this in this video, we are going to see the topic number 7.2, which is in the page number 94 in your textbook. Okay, so the first concept is at molecules and molecular mass. Okay, so in this we must know how a molecule is formed. So for this you had one lesson in 9th standard itself, chemical bonding. So through chemical bonding, chemical bonding only, uh, when atoms join together, we'll be getting molecules. So the same definition is given again. A molecule is a combination of two or more atoms. It may be two atoms, four atoms, six atoms and so on. So it's a combination of two or more atoms and those atoms are held together by a very strong attractive forces and that attractive force is given the name chemical bond this idea you might have from your ninth standard lesson okay so this is the definition of a molecule or we can say how a molecule is formed uh, a molecule is a combination of two or more atoms held together by means of a strong chemical bond okay there are two examples i have given you one is hydrogen molecule and the one more is water molecule okay so look at this hydrogen molecule it has two hydrogen atoms and those two hydrogen atoms are connected by means of a covalent bond so this this is the example for a simple diatomic molecule then water it has two different types of atoms one is hydrogen atom and the one more is oxygen atom and these atoms are connected by two covalent bonds okay so example for molecules then classification of molecules we are going to see how the molecules are classified the first classification is based on the nature of atoms present in a molecule okay for students so depending upon the nature of atoms in the molecule we have two different types of molecules those two types are the first one is homoatomic molecule whereas the second one is heteroatomic molecule we all know the meaning of the term homo homo in the sense it is same okay so same atom which means if a molecule is made up of same uh, atoms then it is called as homo atomic molecule so look at this picture here many examples i have shown you hydrogen the formula for hydrogen molecule is h2 since it is made by two hydrogen atoms it's called as homo atomic molecule then nitrogen also n2 made up of two nitrogen atoms likewise we have oxygen fluorine chlorine bromine and iodine then second type is hetero atomic molecule the meaning of the word hetero is different which means if a molecule is made of different kinds of atoms then it will be called as heteroatomic molecule here also many examples are given water what's the formula of water is yes, very good it is h2o so from this formula itself we can say that water molecule is made by hydrogen atom and oxygen atom so since this molecule is made by two different atoms we can say this as an example for heteroatomic molecule like water we have ammonia the formula for ammonia is nh3 since it's made by nitrogen and hydrogen it's also an example for heteroatomic molecule and many examples carbon dioxide co2 made up of carbon and oxygen then methane ch4 made up of carbon and hydrogen so this is the first classification homo homoatomic molecule and heteroatomic molecule homoatomic in the sense if a molecule is made by same atoms then it is called as homoatomic molecule if a molecule is made by different kinds of atoms then it is called as heteroatomic molecule is it clear yes then next concept it is also connected to the classification atomicity it's very easiest concept Atomicity in the sense the number of atoms present in a molecule is called as atomicity. That's all. Okay. So what is atomicity? The number of atoms present in a molecule is called as atomicity. So depending upon the number of atoms, the molecules can be given various names. Look at this table. If the atomicity is 1, number of atoms present 1 and the molecule will be called as monoatomic molecule. In the same way, if the atomicity is 2, if the atomicity is 2 in the sense the number of atoms present will be 2 which means the molecule is called as diatomic molecule if the atomicity is 3 then the molecule is called as triatomic if the atomicity is greater than 3 then the molecule will be called as polyatomic molecule the molecule may have 4 atoms 5 atoms 6 atoms and so on for all the cases generally we can say it's a polyatomic molecule is it clear students what does atomicity 
yes the number of atoms present in a molecule is called as atomicity okay so here the atomicity of some elements i have shown for you are gone it always will be existing as a monoatomic because we know noble gases never form compounds okay so since atomicity is one it's called as monoatomic molecule helium also is a noble gas its atomicity is one then oxygen o2 two two oxygen atoms no so it's called as diatomic then hydrogen two atoms so diatomic nitrogen n2 two nitrogen atoms so diatomic chlorine two atoms so diatomic phosphorus p4 the formula is p4 no it's greater than 3 it's given here tetraatomic we can say either tetraatomic or we can say polyatomic molecule and sulfur is also given s8 since it has greater than more than 3 atoms this we can say polyatomic molecule so this is these are the examples for uh, atomicity then two more types we have heterodiatomic molecule look at this example students hcl here hydrogen is one atom chlorine is another atom the number of atoms is two yes one hydrogen one chlorine so it is a diatomic molecule then why it's called as hetero hetero in the sense this molecule is made by two different atoms one is hydrogen atom and the one more is chlorine atom that's why this molecule is called as hetero diatomic molecule then hetero triatomic so triatomic means we know the number of atoms will be 3 look at this example co2 one carbon atom two oxygen atoms so it's a triatomic molecule hetero in the sense it's made by two different atoms carbon atom and oxygen atom so it's example for hetero diatomic molecule okay so with this the classification over so from this part i have given you an exercise so students try to complete this exercise uh and send me by whatsapp okay so it's very easiest concept only if you have any doubt you can ask me any time once again i'll repeat you the things we have seen in this video uh, we saw what is molecule what is molecular mass what is molecule a molecule is a combination of two or more atoms held together by strong chemical bond so many molecules we have two examples i have taken hydrogen and water molecule then classification depending upon the nature of atoms present we have two types one is homoatomic and the one more is heteroatomic homoatomic in the sense the atoms present in the molecule are the same heteroatomic molecule in the sense the molecule is made by two or more different types of atoms or elements then atomicity the number of atoms present in a molecule is called as atomicity by using atomicity we have monoatomic diatomic triatomic and poly atomic then we had hetero diatomic molecule and hetero triatomic molecule then finally i have given you an exercise so students try to cover this exercise and send it to me earlier thank you good luck